Oh my gosh, I just filmed a whole intro and I wasn't even recording, so that's awesome. Hey guys, welcome back or welcome if you are new. Today I am kid free all day. Adam's gonna go hunting tomorrow, so he's like, why don't you go do what you wanna do today and then I'll do what I wanna do tomorrow and we'll just take turns watching the girls. But I just got some lunch. I'm gonna be doing some thrift shopping today. I just went through all the girls stuff yesterday that I got them for Christmas. And there are some holes I wanna fill, some gaps I wanna fill. So I'm just gonna be doing some thrift shopping. I'm trying to be more intentional with the things that I buy. I've already found a few really, really cute things from thrift stores, which I will be doing a video in a few weeks. I just wanna make sure everything's here for the video, but I'll be doing a video in a few weeks um, what I got my kids for Christmas, and it's gonna be a minimalist edition. Um, I am trying my best to become more minimal, become more intentional, and I used to be so into like shopping all the time and spending all this money and you know, all of that. Very, very um, consume, consume, consume. I just got to my first thrift store. I'm gonna see what they have here and probably do a couple more thrift stores today and then do my errands. And then I am meeting a friend for a dinner at Outback around 5, 5.30. So that's gonna be really nice too, to get out with a friend and just enjoy the beautiful day outside today. But I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. first thrift store I went to was kind of a bust. Normally when I go there I find like a couple of good things I like. I didn't find, I mean I found one thing. That little jelly cat lovey that I had um, put on there, it was a dollar and I was like this will be perfect. The girls will be able to give like use this for their baby dolls. They're always trying to like give them little blankets and stuffed animals so I'll just wash this up and probably put it in one of the girls stockings for their baby dolls. Guys, that thrift store was a bust as well. So I'm kind of like, maybe this isn't a thrifting day, but I got this little guy, he was 50 cents. Um, I'm gonna put him in the girls, uh, one of the girls stockings. So it's just this cute little bear. I actually might put him in the girls, um, I do a basket at the beginning of, what am I trying to say? <laughs> December. So, and this would actually go really well in Ayla's basket because I had bought her a little moose and I figured that this little black bear would be so cute. Um, and yeah, it was 50 cents. So I'm just, I'm thinking it's not a thrifting day. So I might just give up on the whole thrift day um, idea just because usually when it's a good thrifting day, maybe this is just me, but you start off at one store and it's like really great. And then you go to the next store and it's really great and you get so much stuff. But I just am thinking that it's just not a good thrifting day. So we're just gonna stop where we are and I'm just gonna go ahead and do my errands and get some coffee and just do what I originally was gonna do today. It turned out to be really nice outside i'm wearing leggings a long like sweater top and boot socks boots and then i was wearing that black vest but it is so warm out i'm like sweating but i'm going to head 
downtown. I went to Target to do my return. I went to TJ Maxx to do my return. And I also kind of looked around there. I didn't record just because there really wasn't anything to look at. I don't know why I'm having such a hard time finding things that I like. But I think part of it is because I am more minimal than I used to be. I feel like I would just buy, 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 buy all the time and I wouldn't think about it and I wasn't very intentional about it. I would just buy it because it was cute or buy it because it was cheap. And sorry if you can hear cars driving by, but my window has to be open or I'm going to die of heat stroke. <laughs> I think I'm just going to go into Liana's and Toy Harbor and see what I can find there. I know I kind of want to get, since I got mainly a barn from the thrift store, which you guys will see more in my video when I do the what I got for kids for Christmas video, but I got her this barn. If It was $5. Anyway, I'll talk more about it when I actually show you, but I want to get like a wooden corral. I think that's what you call it to like fence in the barn for her horses, but I know that they have one at Toy Harbor. So I want to go there and then I want to go to... Liana's because I want to look at my lie mouse and or mice my line mice whoa and see if I can find one that I like for Maylee but anyway I've been rambling so I'm gonna go ahead and drive downtown and get a good parking spot enjoy my coffee that I got which I should have gotten a cold coffee not a hot coffee because I stepped outside and I was like oh my gosh it is so warm it is so warm out But yeah, that is what I'm doing next. I'm going to go downtown and I have a couple hours before I have to meet my friend for dinner. So we'll see if I can find some things that I like downtown, hopefully, because I really want to get my shopping done for the girls. I don't want to have to come out and shop when everybody else is shopping. I just, no thanks. <laughs> I would rather not be around all those crazy shoppers. You guys I just got so much but there are like a million people walking by my car right now so I'm gonna park and then I'll show you guys what I got when I get parked somewhere more secluded I am parked now in a more secluded area rather than being downtown when there's like people walking past both sides of my car staring at me but I had a really successful shopping trip first I went and got some pomegranate tea it's just like pomegranate iced tea. It is so good. I really wanted to get another coffee, but that was good and I got tea instead. Anyway, I'm gonna show you guys what I got. I got a couple of stocking stuffers. I went to Toy Harbor first 
and I found a wooden corral, 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 for Maylie's barn. Um, don't mind my eyelashes, I can literally see how wonky they look and it's driving me up a wall. Wooden corral, corral. And yeah, because she has the barn and I just think it's great. It'll be perfect. She can put our little horses around um, the barn. It's gonna be so good. Uh, that was $15. And I did check Amazon too because I kind of wanted to see if, oh my gosh, my lashes. I wanted, I wanted to see what the price was online. Because, you guys, I got her stickers, which can you tell she likes horses? Her stickers were $275 and they didn't come with a ton it was only like two sticker sheets but i like them that they're like realistic they're not you know they're not like um fake horse stickers they're like realistic horse stickers i think she's gonna love that that'll also go in her stocking this is gonna go in her stocking as well it's like this really cute briar horse Briar, Briar. I'm not sure how you even pronounce that to be honest with you. I always called it Briar, but it could be Briar. I don't know. Um, but it comes with two little horses and then there's a surprise horse. Isn't that cute? A surprise foal, surprise baby. So that was adorable. That was $11. And then for Ayla, I got Legos. Um, just like a giraffe and an elephant they don't have these ones so I thought that that would be really cute to put in her stocking um, and that was 12 and it comes with it's not a ton of pieces but I figured that that would take up a good amount of her stocking which is awesome so I like to do more uh, whoop, meaningful stocking stuffers rather than just going to like Target or the dollar store and getting like cheap stuffers that they're actually just gonna throw away or we're actually just gonna throw away in a couple of weeks after Christmas. I would rather get stuff that they can actually keep and play with. Um, and then I went to this place called Liana's and I got um, My Lai. Uh, they came out with a new reindeer. Isn't that the cutest thing ever? And yeah, if you're seeing the tag, yes, I paid $22 for this. But My Lai is so cute and it holds its value. So I'll be able to sell it for at least probably at least half of what I paid for it, probably more to be honest, especially since it's like a limited edition. But uh, Maylee loves her My Lai. So this is gonna go in Maylee's stocking. And then I also got another My Lai. Woo, they're just jumping right out of there. These are the Royal Twins. So they come in a matchbox, but they're just the really cute twin set. And I thought that would be perfect. That's going to go in Ayla's stocking, but I thought that it would be perfect because then they would each have one that is the same that they could play with. Uh, because if you guys have more than one child, you know what that's like. I know you do. Ooh, go in there. So that is what I got for um, stocking stuffers for the kids. I just got done with dinner. It was really nice. I didn't record in there because it was really loud and um, I was just kind of hanging out with my friends so I didn't want to have to worry about getting out my um, phone to record but I just got to Home Goods. I'm going to head in here because the last time I came here I got this really cute baby doll for Ayla and there was one time that I came in here and I saw really cute like wooden um, baby doll accessories and stuff like that so I'm just going to kind of see 
if there's anything in here for the girls well specifically Ayla because her birthday is in January which is just a couple months away so I just kind of want to see what they have here and hopefully I can find something for at least Ayla's birthday <laughs> Let's go outside We can hang out on the beach without freezing Yeah, isn't that amazing? In Christmas times We'll be chilling and having a good, good time Is coming to visit. No, he wouldn't miss this in Christmas times. Oh. It's actually the next day, but I wanted to go ahead and show you guys what I got from Home Goods. I kind of had a clip of this puzzle here. I did decide to get that. It is ages three years and it's only 30 pieces. So the pieces are like bigger and it's a floor puzzle. And I Definitely feel like Maylee's really getting into the puzzles. So, but I needed something that wasn't going to be a ton of pieces and something that's big pieces. So, I got this one, which I thought was so cute. Like the whole mountain scene. I love that so much. And then I got this one, which is like a ocean, arctic animal. Um, we love polar bears and penguins in this house. So, we got this one and this one. I'm sure the girls will share, but these are really mostly for Maylee right now. I'm sure Ayla will like them when she gets a little bit older. But I just kind of wanted to show you guys because they are so cute and they were only $9.99 a piece. So I just loved these two and I think Maylee's going to love them so much. I'm going to go ahead and end the vlog here. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. And I will be posting my What I Got My Kids For Christmas video as soon as I get the last of the items in the mail, which they should be coming sometime this week. So I would assume I would get it up within the next couple of weeks. But if you guys enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!